Okay. Hello, everybody. Today, we are going to be performing a fabulous play known as The Suitcase. In the play, there's a character of a little girl, which will be played by Ilheen. There's a voice, which is voice one, which is going to be Rohika. There's voice two, which I will be playing. There's a man, which will be Michael. And there's going to be a woman who's going to be Anita. So before we go too far away, let's begin. The woman, her daughter, and the man travel in a train in first class. The train arrives at the train station. Excuse me, ladies. I'm going down for a moment. Please try to find out if the train is going to stay here for a long time. I think so, because they're going to put water into the machine. Two minutes, ladies and gentlemen. The train will be here for two minutes. Cinnamon cookies. Cinnamon cookies. Mother, I'm going to buy some cookies. No, remember that when we travel, we have to be careful with what we eat. Can you see how good it was for us to change course? The man sitting with us is so respectful and decent. I think I saw him before, in the St. Louis with a fat woman. Maybe you remember when we went to the movies. Try to me remember. He was sitting in front of us, and she couldn't see the movie. The woman cried a lot during the sad scenes of the movie, and also during the happy ones. Don't you remember? No, I don't remember, Mama. You have such a bad memory. When I see a person once, I never forget his face or figure. Can't passengers to the train. We are leaving. Oh, they are calling the passengers, and the man hasn't returned yet? I hope he doesn't miss the train. Please watch through the window. Can you see him? And the girl looks out and she sees nobody. So she says, A man is missing. A man is missing. Please don't leave. How terrible this is. Where did he go? Change cars because his suitcase is here. That doesn't matter because we can give it to him through the window. Where can he be? I didn't care that we are going to stay here for only two minutes. Let's throw his suitcase out the window. Help me. There it goes. <laughs> Poor man, at least he will keep his suitcase. Take it, Mama. There it goes. To the tra train clerk, this suitcase is of a man who left behind down there. Someone over there can give it to him when he appears. What a careless man. He must have known that the train doesn't wait for anybody. What will his family say when he doesn't show up? Oh my, oh my God, a thousand times. I don't even, I don't even want to think about it. I feel sorry because he was a good companion. And he, uh, and a nice conversation. He was a fine educated man. The train arrives at another station. The man is standing at the door. What is this? Ah. There you, you are here. Yes, I was in the last car. But, but, the train didn't leave you behind? What happened to my suitcase? Where is it? I'm so sorry, sir. We thought you missed the train and we wanted you to do a favor. What? We threw your suitcase to the window. And who told you to do that? Why? We did it for you. 
If only we knew. And now what I'm going to do, I knew you were going to do something terrible. Since the beginning, I was suspicious of you. What are you acting? Tell me how I'm supposed to act. You should have told us where you were going. You are both crazy. Why was I supposed to tell you what I was going to do? Hey, you don't have the right to tell us that we are crazy. Not even to my daughter. I thought you were such a fine, educated man. You don't even know her. I was so wrong. <sighs> But you do know her? You are being disrespectful, and I can't tolerate it. Mama, Mama, come down, come down. Passengers to the train. Passengers to the train. We arrive to the next station. You, you will see who I am. Do whatever you want, but where's my suitcase? Where did they leave it? You have to give it to me. Me? You go get it to the train station. We left it behind. If I picked it up when you were gone. Mama, mama. Mama. Mama, 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 sir, please come down. Now. <laughs> And that's the end of it. How a little suitcase can create a big mess.